you're not for you know uh you know the boss from living forever so it's an acceptable age for everyone to die but use an interesting word which i don't think a lot of people are familiar with um transhumanism mm-hmm. could yes. you define what you mean by transhumanism sure it's basically what everything in tech will be focused on in about 10 years or so maybe five um so <laughs> uh so bas- transhumanism is uh it's like human self improvement with technology so it it's it's a very wide set of things that encompasses quantified self you know like you know like external devices uh it's um body modification uh it is um you know the super soldier serum stuff that you know the myostat and null yeah. and things like that it is brain machine interface like neuralink it is uh neurotropics like cognition enhancing drugs like the movie limitless mm-hmm. it is genetic modification like crispr for genetic diseases you know like sickle cell and other things are being treated with that and so on and so forth it is basically it's a suite of uh oh it's like a you know uh ai used to augment human capabilities it's bionics mm-hmm. right mm-hmm. um it is uh telepresence mm-hmm. it's basically all the stuff which just powers up the human you know limb regeneration right. life extension all right. that stuff is transhumanism now the thing is more recently transhumanism has been attacked as something bad uh because the like people will say when when it's a you know transhumanism is just a change and whether that change is good or bad you you know are you going to create the island of mishappen you know humans or whatever like quasimodos mm-hmm. or you know as a function of this and i understand that fear um and so the term that i use is optimalism and i'm actually i'm going to have a new chapter in the book on this mm-hmm. but optimalism is not 